Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Major Green. Are you tired of constantly repairing your base after every time you get raided? Do you want to build the ultimate defense that'll keep your enemies at bay? Then look no further than this video right here. I'm going to show you step by step how to get that done. Not only will I give you step by step instructions, but I'm going to share my best tips and tricks along the way that'll help save you time on this build. All right, let's get started. All right, this is the two and a half story base that I built in the last video. And if you haven't seen that one yet, you should check that one out. I go over a lot of good tips and tricks inside that video as well. And I show step by step on how to build this exact base. We're going to use this one for the example for today at our uh, defense build. I'm going to make a really strong defense. It's going to take a lot of resources. So to get that done, I suggest getting a van. There's multiple vans located across the map. Just keep searching until you find one. Or if you're lucky, you could find the RV. That would save you a lot of time too. Okay, let's take a look in the back of our van here. I'll show you what I do. I take a few pieces of food and some drink and a little gas repair kit. This is after you've already went out and gathered all this stuff, obviously. But I always bring at least some scrap metal. It takes one scrap metal for me to be able to make a respawn spot you make those right here on this tab on the far right and there's a respawn point now you see it says two scrap metal normally it would take you two scrap metal to build that but for me i have this skill resourceful and uh, that cuts all that in half so 50 percent savings on build make sure you get that skill before you start building your base to begin with let's go ahead and take a look at what else i have i always take a shovel a pick there's an axe for cutting wood. I bring my bow with me and some arrows. That's my main weapon right now. And then I'll use a, probably this fire axe for defense. And that's about all I'll use while we're out and about doing this. And we want all this extra space in here to hold all the stuff that we'll be gathering. So let's go ahead and I think I have some more gas. Let me grab another gas. Yep. And we'll go ahead and fill up a little bit. And then we'll check our parts. You should always make sure you got gas and parts before you go out in the venture with your vehicle. Otherwise you could find yourself walking home. Okay, as you can see, the parts inside are all around 50, 83, that one's 69. And the condition's pretty low. But my character, actually, this time I picked a mechanic. I can repair those parts. So I can take one of my repair kits here. And we'll go ahead and repair and you'll notice that after I do that all the parts get repaired as well see that only on the mechanic class we'll save one gas in there to just in case if we ran out of gas and we had one can we'd know to start heading towards home or looking for more gas we should find some more gas while we're out and about let's go over the build idea for first before we go um I'm going to surround this base and I'll show you in defense with this right here. It's called a wooden palestide wall. Now those take five logs and one rope, but when I do it, it should be uh, two or three logs and one rope. Okay. So we need rope and logs is our main component to build our wall. So we're going to have to go find us a nice spot where there's a lot of trees and or bushes. Okay, here we go. Let's get some trees and then be on our way. We get some more sticks too while we do this and some wood. In case you didn't know, you hold the log, walk up to the back of the vehicle, press F. And then down here where it says your hand, as long as you have an empty space in the vehicle, you left click on it and it loads it in there you'll see it puts it on the roof of the van here and that's it all right and with that piece of wood we are officially full oh here's the tip do you see these brake lights on? 
that means that your parking brake is on so if you get in here try to drive off which you can but you'll notice that the brakes are on you can you can see the puffs of smoke happening in the, the drag line on the road here see but if you press your space bar again it turns it off now to turn on your parking brake you hold the space down and then you exit the vehicle and that will leave your parking brake on and off we go okay here we go now we need to lay out our base now you can lay it free form if you want but i find this is the easiest way load up our build menu and bring out our first piece of wood wall we're gonna do the wooden palisade wall okay now you'll see that from the right side it sticks on there it automatically connects but on the left side it does not so start your wall facing out and then you want to start on this side of the the line where you're going to build from and then just build right on down and make sure that you're in line with this if it starts veering off like coming in this way or opposite going out this way remove them before you you know before you build them make sure it's straight so then remove them if they don't line up see let's continue building this one oops x to remove it see you'll see mine's kind of coming in so we're going to go ahead and remove it and remove the last one because it should be faced exactly the same way it was so then we'll just tilt it out a little bit and try that now you could alternatively uh if it was veering off on the next one you could just tilt it in one and go off from there i just like to start it all over and keep the whole thing straight okay here we are at the end so you, then while it's connected on there you just hold the control to make it spin fast and then to fine tune it let go of the control again make sure it's going straight place like three or four of them and then observe it and make sure it's going straight if you want to do it all in one if not just make adjustments along the way Looks like we got it first try this time. Now, each one of these that we're placing requires a rope. That's why I was saying we're going to need lots and lots of rope. All right, all our walls are set in place. Now, again, these are going to take now three logs and one rope each. And that's a lot of ropes. Um, let's see how much we have in our bag here. We have eight ropes. Um, yeah, we, we're going to need a few more ropes. All right. We have uh, 14, 14 ropes. That won't be enough, but it'll be enough to get started. Let's go ahead and do that. All right. We're down to our last two. And um, yeah, this is how far we've gotten. So this is going to take a while. I'll just come back after we finish most of this off. You just grab this last one out of here. Yeah, this was a whole load to give you an idea how long this is taken. This was a all we could fit in our van right here. All right, here we go. Should be enough to finish this off. Let's see. There's one. And there's one. Okay. That is the main part of our outside wall. I didn't finish in the gate up here yet. I'm going to do that when we do all of our defenses. All right, let me get back in my car. Next step, we're going to have to go get some metal. We're going to need a bunch of metal for this next stage of the build. So let's grab those. Let's see where we're at right now. I believe there's some right over there. Let's go find out. 
All right, for taking out the cars, I like to use a sledgehammer when I have one and an energy drink. Worked out good. I was a little thirsty anyway. The energy drink will give you unlimited stamina for a little bit. So I like to take advantage of it. I'll come back and pick that stuff up after I smash the rest of these down. Be enough to get us started let's gather our goods and we'll head back to base let's design our gate here go to defense i'm gonna put in some windows on this side I kind of like it like that and the next one is going right over here on this side in the same direction there we go yep put our parts in okay so those basic defenses are in right there now let's go ahead to the next stage which is let me show you here barbed wire defense now it should be noted they're smaller than what they look this is a pretty labor intensive uh, defense build but like the title says everything you would need to survive any kind of horde set in place All right, there we go i don't have any oil so i'm not going to go ahead and get it but that's where the generator would go and i already have my lights set up out front 
let's go ahead and switch to our binocular view here all right as you can see i put in the pitfall traps and then on the inside i put or the next layer in i put the logs with barbed wire and then the palestide wall two windowed walls on each side angled in so that you can defend your area here when they come in if they do breach there's a little bit of defense here for the generator you would park right here and then jump on top of your van then you can climb right up in this window up here easily and that's where you would hide don't forget to like and subscribe follow us on twitch we stream daily for youtube and twitch that way you won't miss us don't forget to check out our other build videos i go over a lot of really good tips on those i did a walkway base i even did a fishing dock on one make sure you check those out and as always i'm major green and i'll see you in the next video